This tutorial will show you how to download designs to FPGAs. So after you create your design in the chorus environment and compile it successfully, you need to double check the pin planner and make sure that your inputs and outputs are mapping to the correct pin numbers of the board you are using. You can find the pin assignments in the user manual of the board. So everything seems fine. You go here to program device and make sure that you have the board showing at the USB port. Of course, you have to connect the board to your USB port and also uh, connect it to the power. Uh, make sure the mode is JTAG. And then you need to add device. We are using Cyclone 5. And looking for the board number. make sure it's checked and then OK and then we need to add files if your design is correct and compiled successfully you go to the output files and upload the SOF file And then you hit start. It's showing the progress that it is downloading to the FPGA. And it has been downloaded successfully. And you can run your design and the FPGA.